Hey, this is Adam from Smart Furniture, and this is a guide on how to install the lock on your steelcase furniture. So the locks don't come installed on the uh, desks or cabinets already. Um, this is a guide to show you how to do it. So you'll see here, your furniture is going to ship. It's going to ship locked, and most likely it will still have this plastic holder in place. It's a plastic plug. Now this holds the drawers locked in shipping without the lock being installed. So the first goal is to remove this so that the drawers can be free and then we'll install the lock. So step one you're going to just open this little door. It recommends using a dime. You put a dime in here from the left side you push this tab over and then there's the slot you turn clockwise now the drawer comes free now I'm going to show you a couple other methods in case this came out say this fell out how do you put it back in to do that you're going to do it with the hinge on the right and go straight in so you'll press that in like that now that's there you open the door you'll do the same thing turn uh, Say you don't have this at all, you pull that completely out, you can use something like a credit card, a plastic card. Without that plastic cylinder in there, you'll just go in from the middle, go in pretty deep, at least half a card, then you'll push over outwards. That will flip the latch down, now the drawer comes open. It's this latch that you just flip down like that. Okay, and that's the same thing that the cylinder is doing, it's just turning that. You can also just do this with your thumb if you like. Okay, so now that that's unlocked, this is removed. So you're going to get your lock cylinder. Now this has to go in at a specific way, uh, just at the right angle. A lot of people get, uh, it can be a little tricky if you don't get this in at the right angle. So there's two sides to this. There's the tab which designates the top and then there is just all straight in a row here. These lock parts are just all in a row here. Here they're staggered. Staggered with that tab. So that's what you want on the top. They're staggered with the tab. Also the key is going to go in teeth down. So you have that. That's going to go in at a 45 degree angle. So this is straight up and down. It's going to be 45 degree angle. And then you're going to just go in there straight in. You're going to push it all the way in, turn it to the right clockwise, pull the key out and it's going to set. Now once it's set you can't get it back out easily. So we're going to show you here. Inside here sometimes you'll have to go a little bit left or right but if you kind of eyeball it make sure these grooves in here are just right. Got this here. Tab up 45 degree angle. I'm going to go in right like this. I'm going to turn it. Yep. I kind of just wiggle back and forth there. Now it's set into place flush. Turn it clockwise. Pull the key out. Now when I use the key you can see the latch functions as it should. So the same method is going to be doing if you have vertical doors. It's going to be the same method with that key cylinder or you can slide the credit card up and down to undo the latch. But that's pretty much it and um, that should help you install your locks. Thanks so much.